Hi there, and welcome to this video about how to use Canva, which is an online graphic designer. Whenever you're ready, head to canva.com at the top, or you can always just search for Canva. When you get there, come over here to the corner and you should see a login with Google option, which is my personal favorite because it's one last password that I need to remember. So if you see that login with Google, it's always a great option to consider. And then be sure that you choose your correct student account or teacher account when you log in. So make sure it's the at g.rsd. It is tempting sometimes to select that personal one. This is gonna be your dashboard. This is where everything is located. So you can see you have lots of different designs. So worksheets, tickets, infographics, presentations, business cards, lots of templates that you can pick from. You'll also see if you scroll down all the designs that you've made, you can see that I've made quite a few. So lots of different things keep scrolling you can see things on Instagram you see there's animations that you can pick from Facebook posts social media so let's just say I want to draw attention to something let's do this one this one's cute so I'm gonna select on this and it's gonna open up another window and this is where all of your editing can happen so what's really nice about Canva is everything is completely customizable even the colors that appear there are customizable for you to change so even if you don't like this original one I can always look here maybe there's a different one that I like ooh I'm gonna do this one instead apply to both pages so you can always interchange things if you'd like if you double click here at the top this is where you can change out your title so when you download it you'll know what it looks like anytime you click on a color you'll see that color box appear right here in the corner selecting that color kind of pops open an extra window you probably see the default colors. So you can hit this color wheel and pick a different color. My personal favorite is using the search bar. So let's say my favorite color is pink. Ooh, and now you have all these color palettes that you can pull from. That's pretty. Ooh, now it looks like some of this stuff is too dark. So I'm gonna select on this. Again, anytime you see that color appear, that means that you can change it. And then anything in black, hmm, let's make it all yellow. So that's a really nice shortcut button as well. Okay, same thing with the font. Here you can see all these text boxes are kind of together. If you want to, you can always hit that ungroup option right here in the corner to kind of separate all those boxes from one another. So it's a little easier to click and drag.
Whenever you're ready to share it with your teacher, come over here or share it with your students or share it to your computer. Hit that download option. PDFs are gonna be great for posters, things like that. If you're needing an image, simply select on here and you'll see PNG. So that's gonna be if you'd like an image and you can choose a couple different options. I just want page one. Done. And then hit the download and that will save all for you so that you can share it back either with your teacher or post it. Maybe you wanna make some backgrounds, lots of good things. That's Canva, thank you for watching.